friends, my name is Missy. Thank you so much for stopping by my video today and for watching this channel. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel today and for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Man, has it been a fun but busy week. I just totally said that backwards and I'm just going to go ahead and leave it in because that is the kind of stuff that happens when you sit down to film. So I hope you all don't mind. This is going to be another sit down haul. We went out after Christmas clearance shopping today and I got some goodies and I want to share them with all of you. This one right here I am extra excited about. Cannot wait to show you. If you have not joined our channel yet, I would love for you to do that today. <laughs> We share a lot of thrifting videos here, decorating. We're going to be redoing our main bedroom this year. That is the goal. And my next video, and if not the next, very soon, you're going to be seeing some decluttering videos because my goal for 2022 is less. So if you enjoy all of those types of videos, I would love for you to stick around today. But let's go ahead and get into the haul and I'm going to share with you this right here first. I'm extra excited about it. I have always wanted to put one of these in our bedroom and I'm hoping by Christmas next year we will be able to do that and I thought what better time to get it than when it is 50% off at Walmart and it is a Christmas tree. So I got another Christmas tree from Walmart and I got this for $34.50, which is a great price. It is a six and a half foot pre-lit flock tree. That's it right there. And I am really excited about this. Like I said, I have always wanted to put a tree in the bedroom and I thought that is just going to be a lot of fun so I cannot wait to put that out this coming year in 2022 and this was the only one on the shelf so I really feel like it was made for me. The other thing that I got at Walmart so I got some stuff at Walmart, Target, I just missed my finger, Target, <laughs> TJ Maxx and Bath and Body Works. I would have gone to Hobby Lobby but today is Sunday and of course Hobby Lobby is not open but that's okay because I have been in there a lot this year and I'm very happy with what I was able to find today. I was very selective about the things that I picked up. This next one here that I got from Walmart is an apron and I got this for $3.94 and I thought this was darling and I can definitely use this next year during Christmas for all the baking. I love the old fashioned red and white ticking. It says on here one size fits most. And then the front of it says, see how far I can open this up, it says farmhouse Christmas and it has trees on it right there. So I think this will be perfect next year. And it does have pockets in the front, which I think is great for an apron and so I got that at Walmart as well. We also went to Bath and Body Works and I only got a couple of things there. They're actually just two of the same and they are these shower gels and I think these were Select Body Care there was $4.95 a piece and I love this fireside flurry smell and when I went during the Christmas season I could not find the shower gel, just the lotion. So when I saw those here, there today, I definitely wanted to get them. I was hoping to get lucky and score some candles of the perfect Christmas, but they were completely sold out of all of those. But I did get two of these shower gels, very pretty. And then the notes on this, if you are curious, is toasted marshmallow, pink lavender, and cashmere woods. So I did grab two of those for $4.95 a piece. And then at TJ Maxx, I got a couple of things. And I think most of their Christmas there was like Walmart. It was 50% off. And I got this ribbon here for $3.49. 
and I thought it was beautiful and I have been collecting like music books and music sheets and that's what this is and I think I will be able to really work this in next year with my Christmas decor and it says holy and been so tender and mild and silent night is my favorite Christmas song I thought this was just a really big beautiful ribbon and it's got like a gold trimming on it and I'm really looking forward to working this in next year the other thing from TJ Maxx were these white deer right here from Martha Stewart and they were $12.99 but 50% off so I got them for $6.49 and these I'm actually going to work in immediately with my decor because they're going to go out for winter so I thought this was great if you saw my antique haul I picked up three little white deer little smaller ones and these are just all going to go perfect so I was happy that there was still a set of these there and I, uh, that I was able to get them for such a great price because I will be using them and they look like they're gonna stand up really well which I like and then at Target all of the Christmas stuff I saw at Target was 70% off that I saw and the first thing that I have here are some stockings and the reason I got these stockings well there were two reasons one, I'm really wanting to work more of the greens in next year with my Christmas decor. Really, really go traditional vintage farmhouse, and I think these really fit the bill. I like these ones right here from the Target dollar spot, but when we went to put things in them this year, they were really small and they did not stretch, so it was hard to fit everything in there that we had. And when I was able to score these on 70% off, and there were only three of them there, which again, worked out perfect because I needed three. So they were meant to be for me. These were $15 and to get them for $4.50 a piece was just a great deal. And they are beautiful. Just look at those colors. And I love like the crochet knit, really old fashioned, just super pretty love that green color mixed in there and then they've got this adorable little pom-pom on there and then the little where you hang it right there and then that i just thought these were very very pretty and again i did get three of those one for casey one one for Elijah and one for our fur babies because my stocking my mom made when she was pregnant with me. I've had it all of this time. It's the only stocking I have ever used and so I did not need one for me. So having three just worked out perfect. And then I also got this bag of pine cones and this is the from the Wonder Shop at Target. There are 40 of them in here. They were $5.00. So I got all of these for a dollar fifty, which is a great, great deal. Now they do not have any of like the snow on them like some of the other ones that I have, but that's okay for the price. They will work right in. And this is another item that I can use next year for Christmas, but I'm also going to be using right away coming up in my winter decor. So be sure to subscribe if you haven't yet because I'm going to be doing winter decor very soon. And I think these will just work in really perfectly with that. And then also at Target, I got this countdown calendar from Hearth and Hand. So again, really great quality. This was $19.99 original price, but on the clearance sale, I got it for $5.99. I love it when you can get a great deal like that and on such a nice item. So very, very pretty. This is like a canvas material here. I'm not sure if you can tell that or not. It says Merry Christmas in the red stitching on the front. It has like little pockets right here for your countdown. Now I don't see where it came with anything to like count down so you could just use your own. And then down here on the 25th, it is in red and then the rest of them are in the black. 
but I had a really cute little countdown pillow that I got this year from the Target dollar spot that I used but it had this little green tree that you moved around and it had like a green string attached to it not the best thing for the kitty cats they chewed through that I do still have the tree and I moved it around but I think this will be so much better because I can hang it and they cannot get to it so that is why I got this so we will have a countdown to use for next year that will work a little bit better for us that is going to be everything that I picked up today on clearance. You will have to let me know if you went out and braved the crowds. It actually wasn't too bad at all here where we are. We live in a small area and we stayed pretty close to home, so it wasn't too bad at all. Let me know if you went out, what great deals you got, what did you find. I would love to hear down in the comments. I hope that you're all well and taking care. And of course, I look forward to chatting with all of you down below and in the next video.